Before Rumi's famous transformation, what instructions did Shams et Tabrizi give Rumi? And what steps did Rumi take to rise to such a high level? Goft ke to sham shudi, qibli in jam shudi, jam niyam, sham niyam, dood parakande shudam. No matter what Shams Tabrizi told Rumi, he didn't promise anything. Rumi is playing a love game, a game in which he sacrifices everything, his existence. That's the kind of game Rumi is playing with his divine beloved. He's showing us a dialogue between himself and Shams Tabrizi. He asks Shams to grant him the permission and accept him uh, as his student. And Shams is playing hard to get. Whatever Rumi says, he says, no, you're, you're not ready. And Rumi says, fine, I became a Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim, in the name of God, the All Compassionate, the All Merciful. Hello everyone. In this episode, we are going to analyze a magnificent poem from Rumi's Divan Shamsa Tabrizi. Morde budam zinde shodam, girge budam khande shodam, dolat ishq aamad o man dolat paayande shodam. I was dead. I became alive, I was weeping, I was crying, I started laughing. Love came and I became subsistent fortune. Dide shir ast mara, jaan delir ast mara, zahre shir ast mara, zuhre tabande shodam. My sight is satiated, I have the heart of a lion, I became the luminous Venus. Before Shams Tabrizi I was not alive, I was dead, I was dead to the spiritual truth, to spiritual realities. Shams came and revived me. He gave me new life, not new life, he gave me life itself. گفت که دیوانه نیم، لایق این خانه نیم، رفتم و دیوانه شدم، سلسله بندنده شدم. Rumi goes to Shams, asking him for permission to be his student. And uh, Shams rejects him. Shams says, you're, you're not mad. You don't deserve to be in this place. Rumi, hearing this answer, instead of uh, stepping back, he, he, he gets motivated more. He says, I became mad. What does Shams Tabrizi mean by madness here? Why should Rumi be mad to be able to enter this house, this place, as Shams puts it? Madness here refers to that of love. It is precisely what Plato discusses in Phaedrus, in his famous dialogue, God sent love madness. Divine love comes and transforms the person from within. So much so that they tr transcend their self. So much so that they transcend mere rationality. Shams is saying that you're working solely with, with, with reason and with, with rationality. You, you don't belong with me. You don't belong to this place. And Rumi says, fine, if, if being mad, if transcending rationality is what you ask of me, fine, I will do that. Goft ke sarmas nei, rok az in dast nei, raftam o sarmas shodam, az taraba kande shodam. Sham said, you, you are not intoxicated, you are not filled with joy, you are a material corpse, you, you, you have dedicated yourself to this life, you are not drunken with divine love, you don't know how, what it tastes like, you don't know the joy that comes to you by divine wine. And Rumi, with that humble attitude, humble voice, he says, Rafta musarmas shodam, as tarabo kande shodam. I became intoxicated, I became filled with joy. Now take me. گفت که تو کشته نی در تراب آوشته نی پیش روخ زنده کنش کشته و افکنده شدم. He told me that you're not slain. You have sacrificed. You haven't transcended yourself. You're so bound with your material life, with your material self, that you're not even aware of the spiritual realities. You should sacrifice yourself. And by sacrificing yourself, he's referring to the annihilation in God, fanaifillah, that is transcending one's animal self and realizing one's spiritual self, transcend your lower self, transcend your ego to be able to enter this place. Before his life-giving face, I sacrificed myself to be able to enter that house. Goft ke to zirakaki, mast khiyali yushaki. گول شدم، هول شدم، از همه برکنده شدم. Shams told me that you are smart, but not in a positive sense. You are intoxicated with doubt, 
because you are stuck with rationality alone, you are in doubt. You don't you don't have full certainty about higher realms. And Rumi says, "Fine, I became a fool. If this is to be wise, I would rather be a fool to be your student than to be wise like this. I'm mentally a simple person now." Goft ke to sham shodi, qibli in jam shodi. Jam niam, sham niam, do the paro kandeshodam. You have become a candle. You have become the kibla of this crowd. Rumi was a very esteemed scholar. Before Shams, uh, people came to him, asked their uh, questions, and he was basically a leader. He was the Imam of a mosque. We discussed this in the previous episode. And Shams says that is problematic. That will give you pride. I cannot mentor you with that pride. I cannot mentor a leader. I want you to forget your leadership, to be to, to be empty of yourself, to be a student so that I can teach you. And Rumi answers, I will not be in this crowd. I will not be a candle. I became a scattered smoke. That is, if this is what it takes to be your pupil, I will let go of this as well. I will let go of my leadership. گفت که شیخی و سری پیش رو و راه بری شیخ نیم پیش نیم امر تو را بنده شدم شمس said you have become a sheikh you have become the guide of this, this people you are filled with masterly attitudes with that leader mentality I don't want you go away and Rumi says I'm not a sheikh I'm not a guide I will obey everything you say I will obey everything. He told me that you have big wings. Again, referring to his pride, to his masterly attitudes, to the group of people around him calling him master. I, I wouldn't give you spiritual wings. I cannot do this. Rumi answers, if my wings get on my way, I rip them out of my body. I don't want them anymore. I'm but a simple man now. گفتم آری نکنم ساکن و باشنده شدم The new fortune came and told me Don't be disturbed For out of my grace I will come to you Your wish is granted The ancient love spoke to me And said stay here I will turn to you now And Rumi answers Fine I will do that Now I'm calm and still I'm not going anywhere چشمه خرشی توی سایه گه دید منم چون که زدی بر سر من پست و گدازنده شدم you're the chamber of sun. I'm the shadow of willow. When that light is cast on this shadow, I'm melted and I get smaller and smaller. Now Rumi starts talking about the transformation directly. So far he was begging Shams for, for, for his mentorship. He accepts it and he goes through that process. And now he's telling us what happened at the end of that journey. بش جان یافت دلم واش رو بش کافت دلم اطلس نو باف دلم دشمن این جنده شدم My heart became enlightened with the light of the soul It opened, it split New flowers, new atlas flowers grew out of my heart And seeing this, seeing this renewal, this transformation I became the enemy of this ragged one of this material body Seeing spiritual beauties I'm not obsessed with the material life anymore. Surat jam waqt sahar, laf hamizat ze batar. Bande bo khar bande budam, shah o khuda bande shudam. The form of the soul was boasting at dawn. I was a slave. Now I'm I have majesty. I'm a king now. Zohre budam, maah shudam. چرخ دو ستاه شدم یوسف بودم ز کنون یوسف زاینده شدم I was Venus I became the moon 
I became more enlightened. I radiate more now. I was Joseph before, and now I bring other Josephs into this world. As tu ame shohre qamar, dar manu dar khud benegar, ke az asar khande to gulshan khandan deshodam. Aash tu shatranj ravan, khamosh khud jumle bayan, ke az rukh an shah jahan far rukh far khunde shodam. Oh, the famous moon, I come from you. I, I, I'm sourced from you because of your smile, because of your laughter. I have become a smiling rose garden. Do not speak of it. Be silent. Your whole existence speaks the truth. You don't need to say anything. Everybody knows and it's so obvious that I have become blissful from the face of the Lord of the universes. Whatever you see in me, it's not because of me. It's not because of my individuality. It's not pride. When I'm speaking so confidently, I'm not speaking of my ego. I'm speaking of the illumination that the Divine Beloved has given me. Whatever you see is a radiation from, from that face. This poem shows us the depth of Rumi's dedication to Samsa Tabrizi and to his Divine Beloved. God's words come through Shamsa Tabrizi and Rumi is dedicated. Rumi is determined to walk on this path, to go through this spiritual journey, to transcend himself and unite with his Divine Beloved. And Shams is nothing but a tool here. No matter what Shams Tabrizi told Rumi, no matter what instructions he asked of Rumi, he didn't promise anything. He didn't say, okay, do this, then I will grant you this high level. I will grant you this knowledge, I will grant you this truth. He didn't promise anything. Rumi is playing a love game, a game in which he sacrifices everything, his existence, his self, and he has no expectations. He was not promised anything, but he gave in everything. That's the kind of game Rumi is playing with his Divine Beloved. If you like the content, please subscribe, like and share to help the channel. If you want to watch an episode in which we talked about the first separation of Rumi and Shams Tabrizi, click on this link. And if you want to watch the episode in which we talk about divine wine, love and drunkenness, all from Rumi's perspective, click on this link. <laughs> دیده سیر است مرا، جان دلیر است مرا، زهره شیر است مرا، زهره تابنده شدم. گفت که دیوانه نی، لایق این خانه نی، رفتم و دیوانه شدم، سلسل بندنده شدم. گفت که سرمست نی، رو که از این دست نی، رفتم و سرمست شدم و از تر باکنده شدم. گفت که تو کشته نی، در ترباغشته نی پیش روخ زنده کنش کشته و افکنده شدم گفت که تو زیرککی مست خیالی و شکی قول شدم حول شدم و از همه برکنده شدم گفت که تو شم شدی قبله این جم شدی جم نیم شم نیم دود پراکنده شدم گفت که شیخی و سری پیش رو و راه بری شیخ نیم پیش نیم هم به تو را بنده شدم گفت که با بال و پری من پر و بالت ندهم در حوث بال و پرش بی پر و پرکنده شدم گفت مرا دولت نو راه مر و رنج مش و زم که من از لطف و کرم سوی تو آینده شدم گفت مرا عشق کهان از بر ما نقل مکن گفتم آری نکنم ساکن و باشنده شدم چشمه خورشید پوی سایگه بیب منم چون که زدی بر سر من هست و گدازنده شدم تا بش جان یافت دلم وا شد و بش کافت دلم اطلس نو بافت دلم دشمن این جنده شدم صورت جان وقت سحر لاف هنی زد زبتر بنده و خربنده بودم شاه و خداونده شدم شکر کند خاک دوزم از فلک و چرخ بخم که از نظر و گردش او نور پذیرنده شدم شکر کند چرخ فلک از ملک و ملک و ملک که از کرم و بخشش او روشن و بخشنده شدم شکر کند عارف حق که از همه بردیم سبق برز بر هفت طبق اختر رخشنده شدم زهره بودم ماه شدم چرخ دو تاه شدم یوسف بودم ز کنون یوسف زاینده شدم 
از تو همه شهن قمر در من و در خود بنگر که از اثر خنده تو گلشن خندنده شدم آش تو شطرنج روان خاموش و خود جمله زبان که از روخ آن شاه جهان فرخ و فرخونده شدم